Welcome back everyone, it's your boy Killer NC, and I'm going to show you how to get past that annoying lag that we get when we're watching Cody. You guys know exactly what I'm talking about, so just follow my steps, I'm going to walk you step by step, and you'll be able to get rid of the lag. First thing we want to do is, we got to find an app that's called Easy Advanced Settings. You guys probably have it, 90% of you guys, but if you don't, I'll show you how to get it. So you go to Programs. If you have it, it'll be there, Easy Advanced Settings. For me, it isn't, but that doesn't mean I don't have it. It's just not displaying. So if you don't have it there, click on Get More. And then you'll have a whole list. Make sure you just go down and find Easy Advanced Settings. There it is for me. Click on it. Install it. Once you're done, you'll get the Easy Advanced Settings at the bottom. You want to go back, go back into programs, and you'll see it there in the corner, easy advanced settings with the gear. Click on that. Then we want to go ahead and go and edit settings. Then we'll go to network settings. Then we'll go to network. All right. So the first one, we're going to go ahead and just type 10. Hit done. You see, turn green with the 10 next to it. Go on to the second one. We're going to do exactly the same thing. Type 10. There's a green 10 next to it. The third and the fourth one, we're not going to do anything with. The fifth one, we do have to do a couple extra steps. So I'm going to skip that one for now and we'll come back to it. All right. So the next one down the list, click on that. We're going to go ahead and pick two. Move on to the next one. And on this one, we're going to go ahead and backspace to remove the word disabled. And then we're going to go ahead and pick number five. Hit done. All right. So that's how it should look right now. If you need to pause the video and make sure it looks like that, go ahead. Moving on, we're going to go ahead and hit that other one up. That's the last one we got to do. So to do this, we're going to go ahead and hit back. We're going to go into system, system info. And what you want to pay attention is the free memory. If you look at the top, mine is hitting 3000 megabytes. Just remember the number. You don't have to remember the MB or anything like that. Just uh, look at the highest number that you get while you're looking at it and that's what you want to write down for me I'm just gonna go ahead and go with 3000 okay so once we do that we're gonna go ahead and go back to where we were we're gonna go ahead and go back into programs it should bring you exactly where you left off so now we're gonna go ahead and click on the third one from the bottom we're going to erase disabled and then here's where we got to do a little bit of work nothing complicated don't freak out we're going to have to do two calculations to get the number that we're going to enter here so i'm going to go ahead and get my calculator out and then i'll be back all right guys i'm back and i have my calculator out and like I said, hopefully you wrote down the number that was showing on the system info. What we're going to do here is just start doing the calculation. So for me, it's going to be 3,000. So I'm going to enter 3,000 first. And then you're going to times by 1,024. Okay, hit equals. Now you're going to times again that number by 1024. And then you're going to get this huge number. Whatever that number is, that's the number I need you to enter there minus the commas. So just the numerics. All right, guys. So here we are. I entered the number exactly um, how it was in the calculator. Hit done. It'll show up there. Like I said, everything should look the same except that one. Your number should be different than mine. So once you have all that done, go back. 
want you to go ahead and restart your Kodi. Hit exit. And when you come back, you should either never see the buffering again, or if you do, it'll be really minimal. And the reason for that would be a hardware. So whatever system it is you're using is either outdated, your internet connection might actually be really slow. But for me, I have a good system and a good internet connection. It was just the buffering from source A to me. Um, so this fix should definitely take care of that part of it. All right. If you have any questions, as always, shoot me a comment. I'm always glad to help as much as I can. If you haven't, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I'll keep bringing you videos to help you guys in your Cody path. Until next time, see you later.